That was clumsy. What can I do? Well, if you're quick, catch her up in no time. I'll try my best. So long. Um, I didn't catch your name. Oh, that's right. You didn't. Station Master will do. Oh, goodbye, Station Master. Goodbye, Mr. Daffers. How do you know my name? <laughs> Saxton. Can I walk to Saxton. Yes, there's a path to Saxton. Sedge Marsh. Let's see if we can investigate the wallet. Probably. It's not very feminine. Oh, Lucy Rubens, United College East Anglia. Hmm. And a train ticket looks quite modern. From Sedge Marsh to Sedge Marsh. 26th of November. Seven pounds? Ah, oh, trains today, honestly. Get from like where you're going to where you are. <laughs> but the joy of standing upon the Sedge March platform. Okay. Oh, it is a dramatic reenactment, apparently. Mm. She's anyway. She's left a thumbprint on that as well. Hmm. Well, nothing we can do here. Oh, wow. He is not in a hurry. Which is why you double click. And we're stuck in the fens. Good. We're all going on a summer holiday. Oh, yeah. Bugs. Marsh. Never mind. Yeah, this is summer holiday in England. Ah, <laughs> uh, learning. No! Now, the only thing of particular interest I found is this. The blue flowers that we're seeing. Azurian uh, poppies. Deadly. Taken due to high levels of metrotoxin. Mm -hmm. Lethargy, dizziness, cancer spreads. Cool. And so, we presumably just came off here. So we go right to the sea path, which is closed. And we can go left and um, take the long route round to Martello path Tower. Path closed during spring floods. Ah, okay. Quick path then. Well, there's that, but we should also probably check out the left path just to see if there's anything there. Whoop. We can see more of these flowers. There's a bottle. There's someone out there. Amongst the reeds. I should call out to them, seeing as they're five feet away. This is so smart. Did you ever watch a show called Angela Anaconda? No. No reason. <laughs> that sounds suspicious. <laughs> oh, terrible weather. She's gone. I'll catch her later. Oh, I thought... <laughs> he's really slow. I wasn't in control of that. You have to wait for him to do whatever on earth he's doing. Good grief. Nope. More deadly flowers. And natterjack toads and dragonflies. These are some slippery plagues. Yeah, this isn't exactly a path. It's more like... Oh, more on earth. Hmm. Symbolic images of ancient graffiti. I think it's more like... I'm not sure about ancient graffiti. Seriously, if that was ancient, it should belong in a museum, not in a swamp. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, found someone. Bird watching? Well, let's go irritate them. Hey, how are you? <clears throat> Excuse me. Quiet, man! You'll scare him away! Take his stuff. <laughs> sure. <laughs> the grumpy man. Can't click on any of it, unfortunately. Mm. Let's try bugging him some more. <clears throat> Excuse me. Quiet, man! You'll scare him away! We're being actually fairly quiet whilst he's... <coughs> oh, we've done a loop. Oh, we have to go that way then. Good. Well, there were two possible ways. Ah, this leads into the middle of nowhere. My favourite place. Newspaper. We can get a time... Oh, no, it's not a newspaper. Under... Under... Growth. Under cover. Under over. And... Er... Oh, we got, Ooh, we got a cute little jingle. That's very rewarding. Yeah. Me better about it all. Okay, so we have to use it to hit that guy over the head. Yes. Oh, 
here, apparently. Hmm, right. where are we? The yeah, insects are also in color to an extent. Is there anything which is like. Oh no, not alive. Uh, anything which could potentially be harmful? Oh, we're at Martello Tower. Okay. Uh. Ooh, more stuff. It's not really a tower, is it? It's round. <laughs> and towering. Oh, okay, so overcurrents. That's not right. It is. That's not right. Undercurrents and erosion. It's part of a rusty sign. Click. Part of a rusty sign. Could these parts of a rusty sign perhaps make a complete rusty sign? Oh, is that another part of a rusty sign? It's a piece of paper. Oh no, more rusty sign. <laughs> oh, I see, you have to put it back there. So you have to keep rotating that. Wow. <laughs> Slowly. Oh, you could go anti-clockwise. Uh, you right-click. I get you now. Okay. But we need some more piece of a rusty sign. <laughs> okay. Beware, Dan. Undercurrents and erosion. <laughs> um. No, oh, I thought he just threw it away. There we go. There we go. And more rusty sign in the cave, maybe? Come on. And... Oh, whatever. Oh, no. It doesn't matter. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Let's take a look in the cave and see what we find. There's a monster on this. Oh island. no, a bear! Well, something broke the rusty sign. Hmm. Muscles. Nothing ventured. Nothing gained. And then he bangs his head. <laughs> Simple. <laughs> oh. We'll go further into the cave first. See if we can. Hmm. Hmm. What's this? It's a cave! Oh, there's something on the rock. Just a lot of stuff then. 18th of April. Ah, oh, this new year. Perhaps my time here would be entirely wasted. I'm what? sorry, who are you? What? Yeah. Oh, uh, you work for some kind of organization related to paranormal activity, and yeah. then you steal their stuff, leave, and then decide you want to be a treasure hunter. Oh my god, he is the Indiana Jones. What? <laughs> There's treasure in those fans. <laughs> We don't know anything about him. Except that Evil Corp wants it. Reduce your flesh. <laughs> Just noticed that. That's, wow. That's horrendous. Okay, so, yeah, there's treasure. Can we take it? No. Well, if we ever want to read it again, we'll come back. Can we pick up anything else there? I don't think so. Some kind of sea monster. I don't think it said anything that isn't a question yet. Hmm. Okay then. Oh, hello, random person. Steal his bike. Steal his bike! <laughs> we can't. Okay. Can't even talk to him. We can't interact. Whoop. If you walk closer, maybe it sets up a quick to... something. I think we're standing in a position where we can't actually move anywhere. Oh, oh yeah, that's, that that's Spying Creek. <laughs> this is strange. Please, someone, talk to us! Hit him. What's up with him? Ah, oh, here you are. Excuse me? I'm sorry, I should have said. Good evening. What is that? In the water? A tree stump, I think. Dark and shapeless. It could almost be a small body, couldn't it? I don't know. It's too far away. 
could almost be a child's body. What? We should. Do not fret, my boy. All will become clear. What a delightful woman. And yes, we all speak like this in England. We all speak cryptically to people who clearly don't know what they're doing. Well, only to the tourists, of course. Is Saxton near here? You're on Saxton Shore. So yes, you could say you've arrived. At last. I had to walk across the fender. For like two Your minutes. Train never arrives in Saxon. Why is that? I have no idea, dear boy. Saxon is an isolated town. Hmm. With more likely oh, with treasure hunt. <laughs> what? It's more likely that Saxton simply doesn't have a train station. I'm seeking bed and board in the town. The bear is most likely to provide what you need. A bear? Oh, you mean a hotel? Our protagonist! Oh, I mean the bear. Good you can't grief. Him. He'll be swinging tonight. I'm sorry. Oh, take me, I'm teasing you. You shall see. Well, you shall see. Let's go uh, with the Whoa. least dubious Nigel? Student. He's Nigel? This is new. I'm Nigel, by the way. Yes, Mr. Danvers, I'm sure you are. Am I expected? Oh yes, for some time now, you may change it all. Time will tell. Okay, so the dog is the sanest person on this island. Good to hear. I am a treasure hunter. <laughs> well, well, now there's a thing. Thing? I'm seeking my fortune. Yes, you and the, you and the others. Others? What others? The May Day tide bring many to Saxon. Why is that? High tides eat away at the rocks, cliffs, and sandbanks. The low tides expose that which has been hidden. Like ancient treasures? Hmm, perhaps. That and people's fortunes. And futures. I saw this thing in the cave, and now I want to be a treasure hunter. May I ask you something else? Well, feel free, young man. Oh, cutscene. Is that your dog? No. He's my husband. Is that your dog? Yes. George and I have been companions for many, many years. <laughs> a woman's best friend? No. no. He's a funny man, is Nigel Danvers. I'll leave you in peace. Good. Very well. I'll be seeing you again, sooner or later. I speak with unnecessary pauses. It's rather... Distracting. <laughs> it's like, oh, so we're playing a game where the town of Saxton just trolls this guy who frankly deserves it. Yes. <laughs> the station master called ahead. Oh, we've got another one fell asleep on the train. Be ready. Hmm. What is he poking? It's like a... It's something. And it moves. I don't like it. Well, we can't actually get down here. It's the... It's just a creepy ch- oh no, can't you click on the bike or something? No? Well, I try clicking around this area. Yeah. It's kind of awkward, there's specific points he'll move between these arrows. Can we go up to the house? It's a house. An abandoned building, it looks foreboding. Hmm. It looks foreboding. Ugh. So scary, you had to say it twice. Okay, back in the cave we go. So, obviously meant to go someplace. Oh man, the game's crashing. It can't take all the excitement on screen. <laughs> turn it off, turn it off before we lose it all. 